After many years without an update, Tesla released a fresh design for their mobile app in August. Since then two updates have been pushed out in as many months. Tesla has deployed a third new version to the iOS App Store recently, version 4.2.0. The release notes detail one of the major changes, but hidden in the source code is a much bigger and highly requested feature that hints it is coming soon. Let's get into all the details. So let's get started. Tesla has added quick controls to the larger iOS widget that was first introduced with the new design. Previously, the widget only displayed a few pieces of information, like battery state of charge and current location, but users had to open the app to access any controls. Now, you can lock or unlock, turn on or off HVAC, access charging, and open the frunk directly from the widget. Due to size limitations, these controls are not available on the smaller widget. While the addition of quick controls is nice, what is hidden behind the scenes is much bigger. After years of requests from owners, Tesla appears to be close to finally introducing the ability to watch video from your Tesla on your mobile device. Evidence of this new feature was discovered by Drive Tesla, who found several new images within the app. The images are labeled by the camera view, for example, camera front selected, and shows the typical image used by Tesla to show the viewable area of a camera. There is a large white space at the bottom of the image, suggesting another image of the car will be overlaid to visually display which camera has been selected. It has also been confirmed that this new feature will come with vehicle software update 2021.40. Another feature hidden in the source code appears to be the ability to save a clip after watching it. It is unclear if the clip will be saved directly to your mobile device or if it will be saved to the vehicle's USB storage. It is also unclear from the code if this will only enable owners to view sentry mode footage or if they will be able to view a live stream from any of the vehicle's cameras. Tesla Scope has also found more evidence that this will indeed be live streaming in addition to viewing previously saved clips. They were also able to discover that you will soon be able to talk into your mobile phone and project your voice over the external speaker. Based on a deeper dive into the code, it was discovered that there appears to be daily data limits for this remote viewing. Owners will have the ability to disable live streaming. Additionally, all doors must be closed and no one in the vehicle for the feature to work. There is a lot in this app update. When Tesla releases vehicle software version, 2021.40, in-car purchases will also be enabled. Evidence of this feature was discovered recently. Based on previous evidence, discovered back in December 2020, it could be live streaming, but would be limited only to the same cameras Sentry Mode uses. That's it for now. So what are your thoughts about this? Let us know in the comments. Stay tuned at the Electric Arena for all the latest Tesla and electric vehicle news.